it going everybody? Flint from Flint and Steel Survival bringing you another knife overview. This is actually a double overview. So uh, I'm not going to bore you too much on the details of these guys, but these are buck knives. They are Sim Stag and these came from Walmart. I don't know about you guys, but I always get super excited about November 1st when they start putting out the Christmas stuff at Walmart. When you see the box sets of knives, they do Kershaw stuff. Usually they'll do buck. Um, they always do Camillus. They'll do like an axe combo with them usually. But I always get super excited to see what this year's deals are going to be. Uh, and usually you're getting huge markdowns. Like I got my uh, second buck 110 um, that I actually sent over to Don at Southpaw Bushcraft. Um, I got that for like 30 bucks and I was just blown away last year. But one thing I really like about these ones is their Sim Stag, which is a huge hit for me. But when you're looking at the boxes, these are all different. So the Sim Stag pattern that you see on every single knife is different, uh, which can be expected. But I was able to sit there and look at all of them and pick out the ones I like best of the patterns. The reason I picked this one is it actually was one of the ones with the most white around the sides. But I was super excited to find these. I absolutely love the canoe design. So we'll go over this one first. It's got two blades. This guy is a two and a half inch spear point blade. Um, and the other one is a one and seven eighth inch pen blade. So you've got that guy right there. Still factory oil on him. Just barely got these today. I really like this side too. And 3 and 5 eighths inch closed, 2.7 ounces. The blade steel on both of these guys is going to be 420J2 steel. Um, and both of these blades have the Buck Forever warranty. Um, that means anything happens to them, you send it into Buck and they'll give you a replacement or I think something of equal value, I believe. I'm not fully brushed up on um, their website. Then this is the toothpick. Oh, and this is the 389, and this is the 385. Um, also satin finish, 420J2 steel, two and a quarter inch, really long, thin blade. Um, 0.8 ounces overall for this knife, and same thing, forever warranty. Now on Amazon, I looked these up. You can look up the item number, buck 385 for this guy. The only one on there is $15.61. For just this knife, and they don't have it in the Sim Stag, they only have it in like a dark wood. And this canoe is the 389. Um, you look this up, and all they have it in is wood, and it is 2221. So if you think about this, both of these knives together, let's see, do some quick mental math 3782. If you bought them on Amazon, so I pretty much got them for half off because this is a set that was on sale for $19.99. So killer deal. I absolutely love going to Walmart and seeing what blades they have on their box deals. And then plus you get the Buck Tin. I absolutely love the Tin. I still have my Tin somewhere, I believe, for the Buck 110 that I got. But Buck makes some excellent slip joints. I'm not a huge fan of their folders with locks. But their slip joints are phenomenal. So let's just do a sharpness test. I haven't even checked these yet. Like I said, I just barely got them today. That one's perfect. These two are more the slicers. That's kind of a poker, but... So, so far, so good. And then this guy... Cannot complain about that, ladies and gentlemen. So, But I will give you a spoiler for an upcoming video. I just need to gather up a few more things. The main reason I wanted this knife set is because of that color right there. Brass or bronze, copper. There's going to be an upcoming video where that's extremely important. So... There's your little hint. If you watch through the end of the video, comment on what you think that video is going to be down in the description below. And uh, I'll tell you if you're right. Thanks, guys. Have a good one. Bye.